Hi everyone, so today we are going to unbox the new OnePlus Pro. Alright, so this is here. Oh, this is just the okay, so this is the OnePlus Pro Nebula Blue 12 GB RAM and 256 GB hard disk. Uh, let's go ahead and open it and see what's inside. Alright, so the cost for this uh, online on Amazon was 57,999 as you can see over here. I'll just go ahead and open it. This is the OnePlus community logo. So here we have the, I think it would be the instructions and one accessory. Over here we have a silicon case, just a temporary case for the phone. This is included in the box. This would be, alright, so this is the SIM ejector. Come out. SIM ejector, this would be some of the OnePlus sticker, the OnePlus sticker. This is, these are the manuals. Let's see this. Says go beyond speed, never settle. So I think these are some of the descriptions. Let's keep this aside. So let's keep the phone aside as well from now on. This is a welcome letter, I think it says open over here. Okay. Alright, so there is a welcome note from Pete for all the users. Alright. This comes with a watt charger, it has a 30 watt fast charging which is much more better than the previous one. This would be the same old cable with a USB-C type for fast charging. Now this is the phone, let's unwrap it. It's very nice. Whoa. Wow, so the color is very beautiful. It is some sort of a reflective material. This is a glass but they say that they have put cuts inside so that the light reflects very well and you can see the color very nicely. Nice. Let's see if, let's try and boot it up and see if there's any battery. So now you can see that the phone has uh, booted up. It is really smooth. So likewise they say that it's fluidic. So the screen is uh, 6.6 .6 inches and it's a new AMOLED screen and it has the Qualcomm 855 processor as well as uh, the camera will just see the camera uh, let me I just wanted to see the front facing camera how it pops out let's see wow so this is a double tap and it just go, comes out let's pop it back let's again do it Wow, this is really nice. Okay. So just let's go ahead and see the phone properties, the settings inside. By the way, this has a refresh rate of 90 Hz. So if I screen refresh rate, so it's over here it's 90 Hz. So Likewise, if you keep it at 90 Hz, the battery consumption would be very high, but it is recommended to keep it at 60 Hz. But if you want to feel the vivid display and the smoothness, then you should, I think we should keep it at 90 Hz and test it out. So likewise, we were going inside this setting to be very good. So this is the internal details. CPU as you see Snapdragon 855, 12GB of RAM, 256GB of uh, SSD memory inside. The camera at the rear one is 48 
megapixel which would be this one the main primary camera the other one would be a wide angle camera for 60 mega, uh, 16 megapixel i'm sorry and the other one would be a portrait lens that would be of a 8 megapixel camera so this is a triple camera setup as you can see the screen is pretty amoled 6.67 display and it's an android version 9 it runs in the oxygen os 9.5.3 gm 21 aa so these are all the details this is looks very good i don't know the camera is doing the justice but once i start using it, it i will get to know how well it goes but it is really smooth it is really great so thank you for watching if you like the video one thumbs up would be very nice and please do subscribe to my channel thank you guys